It's a brutal sport. It's really tough. I think it's one of the toughest sports in the world. You've got to be all round, good at everything. You know, the pressures of it, but like any sport, but you've got to be super fit, super strong. You've got to have elite skills. You've got to understand the system. It's a 360 degree game. When I was growing up, I probably didn't realise the significance of having a dad that played AFL. The pressure's definitely been there and the expectation and just the extra attention you get having a dad that played the game. Going to Tack Cup for me was my first elite pathway, I guess you could say, and it, it definitely taught me a lot about the preparation and how much I had to improve. There's a lot of elite footballers and blokes that really wanted to play and worked really hard. So it was a real eye opener for me and, and probably gave me that push I needed at the time. I was a little toothpick when I came in. I think there's a few of us that hadn't seen a weights room. I'm still a light build, but to just try and be a little bit nimble, have quick feet and be strong as I can. If you've got size, it's a huge advantage, but there's a lot more to the game than that. It's only one aspect. Dacos, Rocky's old man, Dacos! Day by day, just making good habits, the food you eat, you know, the training you do and, and, and the recovery you do each day. You know, over time, those things add up. In terms of your energy levels and what you can produce out there training or in, in a game, eating well is a huge aspect of it that you definitely learn as you're in the system longer. It's definitely helped me feel better and, and definitely helped me, helped me get fitter. That's a big part of our training protein. Before training, main training sessions will definitely We'll have a shake, um, and then as we come off, straight away, the shake's made for us to get that protein to help our bodies repair straight away and help us feel as good as we can. Looking at this, I, I remember, this is probably when I was on the fringe most years, and the improvements I've made are noticeable. Physically, how I've changed, I'm moving a little bit better. Probably been more above the shoulders, just mentally, knowing that I belong. I physically put in the work, but I think a lot of the game's so, so mental that you know, you've know got to be going in there confident, knowing that you belong, and that's probably been the biggest thing for me that's helped my football. You know, I've got aspirations you try and achieve and, and goals that you like to tick off, and for me, I just like to be you know, respected in the league, you know, as a decent player, and, and just along the way, enjoy my football. That finish, unbelievable. Still haven't proven myself. I'm far way up from it in this league, so you definitely going to each game and each training, understanding that you've got a way to go, and that mindset definitely keeps me instead. <laughs>